John from Bonapro, and we have a new packaging solution for Rocket. Uh, Rocket's now going to come in a five gallon bag in a box, which will give you uh, more product for the same amount of space, 80% less plastic. When the valve is closed on the box, it's sealed, so you don't have to worry about a cap being on loose and solvent or peroxide off gassing. You're less likely to glug uh, because of the pore spout and your, your employees will be inspired to use a measuring cup which gives you a more accurate mix and less waste. So when you get your uh, rocket, it will be in an over box and that's just a protective box for the main package. The easiest way to do this is just turn it upside down, remove the over box, and now we have the five gallon bag in a box. So what we're gonna do here is we're gonna cut off, there's a little piece of tape here that holds the plug. We're gonna remove the plug and inside is a pour spout and there is a, kind of a built-in handle here as well also. So it's just gonna make it easier for you to transport it. <clears throat> You'll pull this up. We will remove the cap and then we're gonna remove the seal. If this doesn't just peel off, and if it's properly uh, thermal sealed, it won't. You'll need to take your razor blade and you'll give it a little cut around the inside. And um, we'll remove that. That one's swimming. We'll put on uh, the spout. And before you completely tighten it, put this um, <clears throat> so it's facing down and then tighten up the nut there. And now we have bag in the box. So it's very easy, very simple. This will actually be more cost effective than buying five one gallon bottles of rocket. Plus you're gonna, it's like getting a free gallon sh ship for free because we're still gonna do the $7 shipping but you're gonna get five gallons instead of four. So you get a free gallon shipping. And then also this will be a little less than if you had bought uh, four gallons with a um, case and a single a gallon separately. That would have come out to $200. This will be $189 plus you get the shipping advantage. So this will uh, fit on shelves uh, in your van. If there's racks in there, you can put it on the side of the van if you don't have racks. I would suggest just in case valves can leak sometimes, um, you just put this up when you're done. Just to make sure in case there would be any type of failure with this valve mechanism that you are sealed. But what's good about this is <clears throat> with a gallon, if you go to put the cap on, it's not completely on, that can off gas and vent out. Whereas this, when it's closed, um, it's sealed. So the product will stay fresher longer for you. So when you're bag in a box, originally came, it had a venting thermal seal on the packaging, and then it had a venting cap on, um, on top of that. So if you're gonna leave this for any period of time, you're gonna wanna remove this pour spout, and you're gonna wanna put the venting cap back on. So I'm not talking days or anything, but if, if you're gonna be on vacation or something, you want your rocket to go bad or potentially cause this to expand, depending on how much is left in it, um, you wanna put the venting cap back on. So go ahead and save that cap. So just to show you this in a little bit more detail, when you take your um, venting cap off of the product after you've um, unpacked it, your seal looks like this. So when you when you cut the hole in it, you're essentially gonna be leaving this ring on the outside. So let's go over to this one. I've, I've cut this one already. So this ring here will act like a gasket. So when you put on the cap, 
you'll get a, a seal. If you take part of this off, this is more likely to leak. So you have to get it all off without uh, putting a notch or a cut into um, the threaded area, or just go around on the inside with a razor blade, take that center of the seal out, and then leave this as a gasket on the outside. So then when you put this on, um, you get a good seal. So um, if you need to, you can use a wrench. If you've got uh, strong hands, you can tighten that up pretty good. And it, So when this is all the way to the right, it's closed. If you turn it to the left all the way, it'll come out slowly. If you back off a little bit, it'll come out much faster. So with this closed, if you want to, depending on your hand strength, I, I'll use a set of uh, pliers and I'll tighten this up so it doesn't leak on me. And then you're good to go. You said if we bring that all the way out, that, that'll come out fairly quickly and then just turn it off. I like to flip this up when it's done, just in case there is a leak or if the valve fails or whatever. That way, uh, nothing's going to spill and you're not going to lose any material. So it's a safety precaution. I just like to flip this up when I'm done with it. So uh, less packaging, less space, better value, and we should have uh, this back in stock very quickly now for you. Any questions, go to info at bonnetpro.com or call me at 877-477-1615 or visit, visit us on Facebook in Encapsulation Cleaners World. Thanks. We'll see you soon.